Hi, David. This is Pam, your reading buddy. I thought today we could read a story. Can we go now? Well, I wonder where they want to go. So the story is Can We Go Now? Written by Anne Harth. So let's take a look at where they want to go and what they want to do. Nathan wanted to fly his new kite. Wow. Have you ever flown a kite? Would you like to fly one? He looked at the sky. The leaves were still. Can we go now, he asked. Not yet, said Dad. So there's not enough wind out there to, to fly the kite yet. Nathan put on his shoes. He's got his shoes on. He's tying up the laces. He's getting ready to go outside. He looked at the sky. The leaves fluttered. Can we go now, he asked. Not yet, said Dad. Nathan put on his hat. He looked at the sky. The leaves flapped. Can we go now, he asked. Not yet, said Dad. Nathan put on his jacket. He looked at the sky. The leaves flew from the trees. Can we go now, he asked. Dad opened the door. The wind rushed through the house. He grinned. Now we can go. So there's enough wind out there so you'll be able to fly his kite. Look at that. So let's look at the questions here. What are Nathan and his dad going to do? Well, they're going to go out and fly a kite. Because Nathan has a brand new kite. What kind of day is it outside at the end of the story? Well, it starts out as a really still day, but by the end of the story, it's all windy and a really good kite flying day. What does Nathan do first? Well, he gets ready to go outside by putting on his shoes. Why did Nathan's dad wait to go outside? Well, his dad waited until it got windy. You need wind to hold up the kite in the air so it can fly on the breeze. So it looked like by the end it was nice and windy and they'd have a good kite flying day. Well, I hope you're having a good day and enjoyed the story, Can We Go Now? Goodbye until next story time.